Hello all, happy Monday. Today is January 30th, 2023. And welcome to this episode of your daily video announcements. I'm Leland. And hello, I'm Kyer. So frustrated about the game. How can referees have so much power to totally make bad calls, to kill a team's momentum in a game, mismark ball advancements, crazy pass interference? Ugh. Okay, enough about the bad refs game. Let's move on. And it's wonderful to have this great opportunity to join you on a daily video announcement. Now please let's stand, place our hand over our heart, and let's honor this amazing country as we said the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Tomorrow, January 31st, is Clubs and Activities Picture Day. Look great for your group pictures and make sure to check your schedule for your group picture time. Next week, we have teacher conference coming up as well as third quarter interim reports. Make sure that you are doing all your homework and studying for your test. Nice. Thanks for the helpful info. Next up, did, did you, you know? The average U.S. household has 300,000 things in it. That's well, that actually makes sense because... It's a U.S. household, of course. Next up, National, National day. day. Today is National Croissant Day. They're yummy and awesome, toasted in the oven. Next up, Birthdays. birthdays. Happy birthday to Naomi L., Zachary B., and Maya T. Yes, happy birthday. Hope you have an amazing birthday. And now over to Mr. Harris. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your daily video announcements. All right, uh, we need everybody to pay attention to this. Students that ride bus number seven home, you will ride bus 31 today. Bus 31 will be parked in the spot next to where bus seven usually parks. So again, if you usually ride bus seven, today you're going to ride bus 31, and it will be parked right next to where bus seven usually parks. Congratulations to our junior high robotics team. A little trophy action. Um, our eighth grade team made it to the final four alliance teams competing with and against the top 24 Cincinnati area high school teams. And our seventh grade team wowed the judges to take first place in the Motivate Award. Congratulations, robotics. All right. Eighth grade boys interested in playing soccer at the high school next year. We will have a meeting with the varsity head coach, Coach Whistle, doing Flex Bell on Wednesday, February 8th. Please email Mr. Tanaka at Tanaka K, uh, sycamoreschools.org so that he can share a Google link for you to sign up online. At the meeting, you will learn about summer training, tryout process, and can ask any questions that you might have. Hey, this weekend we had the GMC Wrestling Tournament, and Sycamore had quite a few wrestlers place in that tournament. We had three people place in second place, uh, Dozier, uh, Ross, and uh, Abdullah. Abdullah Jabber, sorry. We had one wrestler, we had a wrestler place third, Pinkert. We had two wrestlers place, we had a wrestler place fourth in his song. We had two guys place fifth, Wade and Kenny. And we had a, a GMC champion in Garrett Hughes. So congratulations to our wrestlers. Great job at the GMC wrestling tournament this weekend. All right. And remember, our standard Monday announcement about Murray, the service dog. Remember, he's working when he's at school, so do not pet him unless he's wearing his bandana. And always remember to ask Luke if you can do that. All right, that's it for me. You guys have a great day, and we will see you tomorrow. Thanks, Mr. Harris. Now over to the students of the week. All right, our first student of the week is Lucas Moore. Lucas, come on over. Uh, Lucas was nominated by Mr. Winkle for being safe, for being responsible, and being a problem solver. So, Lucas, there's your certificate, and more importantly, there's your Chick-fil-A. All right. Our next student of the week is Gutham Ramajuam. I know I was going to mess that up, but that's okay. I gave my best shot there. Uh, and Gutham was nominated by Mrs. Wolford, and again, for being safe, for being responsible, a problem solver, and respectful. There's your certificate. Congratulations. And our last student of the week is Omkar. Omkar Seth, and Omkar was nominated by Mr. Wolf, and he was also nominated for being safe, being responsible, being a problem solver, and being res uh, respectful. So remember, on uh, every week we have our students of the week, and they, mod they model our PBIS characteristics of being safe, being responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. So congratulations to this week's students of the week. We are out! 
Great job, students of the week. Now over to our character awards with Mr. DeJoy and Mr. Stern. Good afternoon, Aviator Nation. Mr. Stern and Mr. DeJoy here to do this week's uh, character awards. How was your weekend? Great weekend. How about yours? Yeah, yeah it was good and, until last night, yeah. of course. Tough loss, tough loss. But when you're a Browns fan, you're, you're used, used to, to it. it. And actually, <laughs> our, my team hasn't played in a few weeks. So, uh, hey, great job, Bengals. Uh, great season. A lot to be proud of and to build on for next year. Fantastic. This character award goes to Emma Sprang. It says, in sixth grade, when I was new to school, you were the perfect friend for me. You are so nice, and we hit it off right away. You're an awesome friend. And yeah, you know, you really want to be remembered by someone. Um, definitely, when you have a new student that joins your class, if you kind of embrace them and show them the ropes, you will always be remembered. It's, uh, I, I don't know if you were ever the, a new student. I was not. I, I was not either, but um, I can only imagine the feeling coming in, not knowing anybody or knowing the layout of the building or whatever. Yeah, everything everything is so yeah. so different. So, and uh, who do you have this week? Well, sure. Uh, so I want to talk about Asher Parin, and Asher is always nice and always makes me feel comfortable. He he made he has made me feel like I fit in the school, and he's been a great friend to me this year. So great job, Asher. We really appreciate what you do here at Sycamore Junior High School, and uh, I know that person's very proud that you are their friend. Yeah, he's a, he's a good kid, Asher. Uh, this week, uh, you are going to... Um, I'm having a brain cramp. Are you going <laughs> to... Is it Huff? Oh, we're going to uh, Miss Huffman's room. Huffman, yes, and I yes. am going to uh, Mr. James because we visit classrooms on Thursday, but you can make a difference any day of the week. All right, have a great day. Thank you, and great job for making those good decisions. Now it's time for the joke of the day. Where did the music teacher leave her keys? I don't know. Where? On the piano! <laughs> <laughs> oh, the piano! Just stop playing with you. Hope her keys weren't flat or sharp. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Classy Sycamore, and follow PBIS expectations. Have a wonderful week, and go, go Waves! waves.